Hey everyone, this is Harley with GardenFL.com. Today we are going to be replanting sugar apple seedlings that I actually brought back from Colombia. Now these sugar apple seedlings, they already started to, the root has started to grow at the bottom. So we are going to be transplanting them into bigger pots and also we're going to be adding some extra nutrients that sugar apples love and that they will thrive in. So let's get started. So this is what I'll be mixing into my sugar apple formula. The most important thing here I would say are the earthworm castings. Now as someone who has a pretty big orchid of sugar apples here in Florida told me that their secret to getting really good sugar apple growth and taste is earthworm casting. So I'm just going to take their advice. Uh, they also say peat moss. It's very good to add in there and as well as your compost and your gardening soil. Now I'm actually going to be um, adding a little bit of native soil into there because they already have some native soil. Here are our sugar apple seedlings. Here's one of them, has really good growth. Here's another one. And then we have them all kind of around the property. Here's a lot of them that I have to transfer. And as you guys can tell, they're already growing out to the bottom. Here we have a really nice sugar apple. And as you can see, it is starting to root at the bottom. All right guys, so once we have optimal soil um, that we like, this is time when we're gonna transplant our sugar apples. Now, something about transplanting sugar apples is that they're shallow rooters. So you gotta, you wanna make sure you get a pot that's not too deep, but um, you know, any regular pot should work. Just don't get a long planter. This a size about this should work just fine. And I wanna upgrade. Now I plan to leave this plant alone for a few years in this potter. So that's why I kind of upgraded the size and stepped up pretty big. when it comes to waking up the roots but for these I'm extra gentle just because they're my favorite fruit and um, these seeds I brought back from Colombia so I can't get any more um, so that's why I'm trying to take very good care of the plant and of the roots. Bye, thank you guys for watching. If you wanna see more of my garden, please make sure to follow me on Instagram, uh, Garden Florida. Also, if you wanna check out the blog, www.gardenfl.com. All right guys, bye-bye.